to identify the correct box and whisker plot to represent the data that they give us. And I will tell you, the first thing you probably want to check on is the highest value and the lowest value. And that's where those whiskers should be at. So when we look at answer choice A, the lowest value is not 65 and the highest is 85. Same thing with answer choice 2. Now when we get over to answer choice 3 and 4, they have the same minimum and maximum values, but the difference is the medians. So if we could determine what the median is, we could successfully answer this problem. So we're going to list our data set in order from least to greatest. So we have 69, 70, we have 70 again, 71, 72, 74, 76, and then 78. And now all we're doing is trying to determine what is the median slash middle number. So we'll add these two numbers together and then divide by two. When we do that, we're going to get a median of 71.5. And when I look at my answer choices, it looks like answer choice three is going to have a median, right, that represents 71.5. And this is how you could use process of elimination to find the correct box and whisker plot based on the data that they gave us.